Hello everyone, this is my re-review for Sniper Elite 4 on PC. This is a recording from my YouTube channel, as you can see in the corner. Because I don't have the game installed anymore, and my last review was to my unbeknowing, complete and utter crap. So I am redoing it. I do apologize for the bad quality at the time of recording. I did not know that I had options to change the quality that I could record at, but now I do. So I apologize. But my review of this game is if you are into snipers or whatever or guns in general, it's worth it. It is for you. I had a blast with this game. The x-ray mechanic, holy crap, it is wonderful. You will enjoy it. Seeing how the bullet destroys the human body is it's amazing and it's also scary at the same time. Seeing the human body just get shredded is honestly how they managed to do that for the game. Good, kudos to the developers on that. Like, it is just... That's like a major pro for the game. This, I have no cons at all for the game. At all. Like... There's no bugs from what, from what I remember. I, like, at all. So, I have no cons for it. It's not that old of a game. It's fairly recent. So, like... The game's just fun. I recommend it. It is a solid 10 out of 10. Again, I know I have a ton of them so far, but honestly... I give fair reviews. I can't help it. The enemies can spot you from, you know, far away, and you have a timer before you are fully spotted. But, like, I mean, and you have to use your environment around you to, you know, position yourself. Like I did here, your eye through a rock to distract an enemy so I can get a better shot at him and I'm trying to aim for his grenade which, I, which was on his grenade, a grenade is like his stick but I'm trying to get I think a um, a testicle shot with the x-ray I believe I was trying to do that, I was trying to get the x-ray to pop off and have the bullet go through the man's nuts because yes, this the x-ray system does show testicles. Was this hysterical? And they are humongous. Holy crap, they are huge. There are different phases in the enemy, you know, alertness. They will search, they will hunt. This might be an x-ray. Yeah, here it is. X-ray. Like, that right there is just phenomenal. I love that. And you do gain levels. The levels, you just mostly unlock new things, like new new guns with the perk points you get. There are, I think, some cosmetics, but it's just like an... It's not really a cosmetic. It's like it's a different character to play as. That's really all it is. Like, it doesn't benefit you any. So there's no point, like, at all. Because why would you play as someone else? Play as your main character. Play as Carl Fairborn. Like, what's the point, in my opinion? But whatever. There are no, like, nefarious gambling mechanics or nothing. Or anything like that at all. There's no... There are DLCs. 
one of which you can kill Hitler, which is fantastic. So if you want to kill Hitler, go for it. I did. <laughs> I did all. I did all of the missions in this game, even the DLC ones, and I and I got rid of Hitler. It was great. It was fun. And if you're wondering how how true to likeness the the game version of him is, oh, it, it's very accurate. It looks like him. It does. It looks exactly like him. One to one, basically. But anyways, this has been my review. Hopefully this one is better than the previous one. Not just, you know, me staring at a um, playlist screen the whole time. Was, you know, I didn't know any better back then. Now I do. <laughs> Thanks for the advice, by the way. It means a lot. To the person who, you know, commented. But anyways, I will see you guys later and have a wonderful day.